Well, if you've been to the Country Club Plaza recently, you may have noticed Brush Creek. Looks fairly clean and clear in that part of town, but as you head from west to east, things start to change. Reporter Dan Cohen shows us how things look downstream. In the city of Fountains, there are many waterways and water displays, but one area of Kansas City's Brush Creek is not so inviting. I see pond stone and trash and old branches and yuck, <laughs> that's what I see. Judy Rimson lives east of the Paseo, overlooking Brush Creek. These pictures are from her view, and we saw the same thing at creek level, a lot of pond scum and trash. People that have lived here for 10, 15 years, and they've looked at the same thing, and it also smells. At Prospect and Cleaver, Brush Creek is still and filled with that pond scum you just saw. Here in the plaza area, though, the water is moving and it's clear. Judy has lived in her apartment for six years and told us she has reached out multiple times to the city's Parks and Recreation Department asking for help with cleaning up the creek, but she told us that she hasn't received a response. We reached out to Kansas City Parks and Recreation and they sent us this statement citing quote staffing constraints and limited resources as factors in their delayed response. Third District Councilwoman Melissa Robinson says the creek dam in this part of the city is not concrete based like it is in areas west of the buildup. It's a mud based dam and so all the trash just really flows from other parts of our region bounces off and it sticks all in at Brush Creek. Robinson told us she has personally worked on this issue for seven years. When we talk about environmental racism and we talk about environmental injustices, Brush Creek is that case study example of the differences um, that have happened over decades, over decades. But change could be coming soon. There's a new project manager at KC Water to focus on the problem with a feasibility study and community feedback to follow. Judy Rimson is hopeful for a cleaner view out her window. There's a lot of good people out here and we do care. You know, we care about what our neighborhoods look like. And I would like to see the same water on this side. In Kansas City, Dan Cohen, KSHB 41 News.